Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Alan Anthony. The folks I got working here at CES, and we're looking at the Honor and Magic. It's the Honor and Magic. These are the specs right here. If you want to pause it and read it for yourself, definitely can. Now, it does remind me of the S6 Edge or the S7 Edge, because it does have the corners rounded from the side, but it definitely is very, very light. In the back, it's a different type of uh, look to it, because it does have a nice gloss. Almost reminds me of the Jet Black color that's on the iPhone. It's really, really nice. We do have the Honor logo right there in the bottom, but it's covered up by the security cable. Uh, you have the buttons right there. See how the camera looks. So that was pretty fast. I don't know if you guys caught that. So it looks pretty good so far. One single speaker, headphone jack, of course. It's very thin on top of it. Really thin. So as far as the spec, it's not really showing me any spec rundown on this one. Uh, let's see what's running actually. The front actually looks like a, looks like a fingerprint scanner. Let's see what we have here. So there's no touch capacity buttons in the front, even though it kind of looks like that. That's probably because I've been handling a lot of Samsung devices. Let's look at the... Is there any about here? We shall see. System settings, okay. About phone. Okay, the Honor Magic. 4 gigabytes of RAM. 2K display. Security patch. Here it is running. I'm trying to find the build. It's a build number, the Android version, 6.0, so hopefully we can have an update on, uh, on a new bit, so we're not out. Check this out for yourself. I don't see an app drawer on this. This is probably a part of the actual UI. Alright guys, if you want more coverage of TS 2017, this is Phone Tech at Work, and this is the Honor Magic.